Mr. Innes is an incredible educator, one of the best in the school. He truly knows how to get the message across for whatever he's teaching. And he's not teaching an easy subject, he's teaching math. Hi, Mr. Ennis. Hi. Mr. Ennis is an amazing teacher. He really connects to the kids. All the kids love him. He will stay after school and use his breaks during lunch and during any free periods to concentrate on a specific student's needs. He will sacrifice his free time for the sake of learning. He also likes to make math fun. What's section 4 one? He teaches us more than just math. He teaches us about life and how to be independent and skills that are very practical to our lives, so we're very thankful for him and we're very happy to have him as a teacher. Well, Mr. Ernest is lighting the path to education. I was born in Kansas, but I don't think I stayed there more than five minutes. I then was in Colorado for up to third grade. Then we moved to Texas. It was a cowboy culture. I lived in a very small town, 10,000 people. I worked on a ranch. It's in southwest Texas, down on the Mexican border. And it was hot, desolate, 115 degrees in the middle of the day in the summer. And it was 60 miles to the nearest village somewhere else. Many of the things that other people experienced back in the 60s didn't occur in our town. And I spent the rest of my high school career in Texas. Eagle Pass High School, Eagle Pass, Texas. My stepfather worked for the U.S. Department of Agriculture. He actually became the supervisor for the state of California. My mom was a housewife, although she had an electrical engineering degree and worked for Boeing aircraft during World War II. She helped design and construct the aircraft. And my father, he had an actual MD degree and worked for the armed forces. I graduated from high school and was asked to come to the University of Miami on a track scholarship. Completed the requirements to be a math teacher. I interned at Miami Killian. I stayed there for 35 plus years. I retired at that point. Mr. Morris and Dr. Lieber, they called up and said, we want you to be the math department head. I've been here ever since. Three colon five. Method two. Yes, sir. No student wants to be as organized as we're making them be. The reward is when they come back and tell you how easy it has made their college life. Many of the students that they run into in college ask, how did you learn to do all of that? And they said, I had this knucklehead math teacher that showed me what to do, and it's just now second nature. I'm enjoying working with the administration, the kids, and the teachers that are here. It's great that they saw fit to honor me in this form. <laughs>